Hey guys, this is Leo I'm Chewing Gum bringing you another video and today I'm very excited to see and to take you on a video walkthrough through Toys R Us. Yes, Toys R Us is back here in New York City, here on 34th Street, Herald Square, inside of Macy's, Herald Square, uh, right by Penn Station, right here on 34th and 7th Avenue. Uh, here you see uh, the giraffe, Jeffrey. It's his birthday, I guess because they're opening the store or because it's really his birthday today. Uh, we're gonna go up here, it's in the seventh floor. I uh, don't know what to expect, so uh, I'm very excited. Uh, I'm expecting a lot of nostalgia and a lot of uh, what I uh, experienced as a kid. Uh, we'll see. But as you can see, the front of Macy's is nice and decorated. So let's go inside and let's see what they got. All right, so we've reached the top. You can tell in Macy's that you've reached the top floors because of the wooden escalators that are located here, as you can see. Uh, pretty cool looking ex escalators at least, but you can see that it is, uh, once we reached the top of Toys R Us, here it is, here's a sign. Um, well, we have clothes here around here, but we are at Toys R Us. Let's see, there's Jeffrey the Giraffe. All right, uh, there's clothes here. Where is Toys R Us is what I'm trying to see. I, I was expecting the whole floor to be Toys R Us. I was expecting um, everything to be so decorated. I guess it's back there. I, I see the Toys R Us sign over there. So let's go over there, uh, take a walk and, and see uh, what we have here. But so far when you walk in, I was expecting to be welcomed to the seventh floor by Toys R Us and the colors and the red the blue and the green and the yellow and the giraffe hitting me in the face with uh, toys r us but here we are it looks like we are here uh it's a little section i believe this is uh there's a statue of liberty uh but i guess this is it right here this section of the store um i would say looks like half of the store maybe i don't know maybe Two four uh two fourths one fourth of the store of the at least of the floor of the seventh floor uh is taken up by these toys i don't know if they're gonna expand it or anything but let's uh take a look and see what we got with these toys over here got some dolls we have more dolls over here in this section big old teddy bear over there got the bratz dolls over here we have uh, disney princesses we have the surprise uh, Encanto. My daughter loves this. Oh, you know what? I've, I've never seen that toy before. Uh, that uh, Luisa toy. Oh, I maybe have to pick that up. Got a bunch of adorables here that I've never seen anywhere else. So that's pretty cool to see different kinds of adorables here. Uh, maybe I'll pick some of those up here. They got some Disney Princess little surprise book bags over there. I mean, those are pretty cool. I've I've, I've, when I go to Target, which is usually where I buy toys for my daughter, who is three years old, um, I, uh, you, you know, usually go to Target or Walmart and I find what I'm looking for, but, uh, here, I mean, for the surprise bowls specifically, like the door bowls, it, it looks like, uh, they have some different ones here and they have this little, uh, little light thing. I can't think of the name at the moment, but, uh, that is it light bright that that's what it is with a light bright uh we have uh jeffrey here we go dressed up as santa claus the giraffe um uh, have a little kids section to try out toys right there in the middle of that square cube looking thing we have more dolls more baby alive dolls over here okay have more toys here more uh, dolls and more baby dolls you and me dolls here uh, looks like they have a little playground behind this more surprise balls down here they have a little playground in the middle section here uh there it is a quick little look 
out of the respect of the parents i do not want to record uh the little kids um for their own privacy so but that is it. it looks like it has a slide a little bit of a house not 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 too big uh we have wwe figures here uh yeah going back to the playground it's not too big it has a little slide and a little house that's really it nothing crazy uh probably about the size of the little indoor playgrounds you see at the malls uh for for kids uh we have beyblade over here uh you know toys the carpet is colored in green blue orange as you can see uh, we have harry potter toys more dolls more harry potter now we're gonna go to the barbie section i believe it looks like 20 percent uh, off special here pop play bunch of dolls heads to comb the barbie's hair and here we go we have a backyard of uh, barbie's dream house i believe or one of barbie's dream houses or a malibu barbie house or some sort of house maybe a condo i have no idea there's a little swing set a little slide a little stroller and there is barbie the barbie uh logo we have lol surprises here lol more lol surprise balls over here all surprise toys here now we're gonna go into the action figure section we have transformers here we have dc comics over here black adam new movie that's come out more surprise toys over here more dc right here we got a little batman here lights up this has a couple things more 20 percent off original price for black adam toys we have star wars over here some cards with grogu and more grogu stuff here or baby yoda however you want to call them if you watch the series all that good stuff some dinosaurs little plushy looking dinosaurs over here from jurassic park okay we have more action figures power rangers little power rangers section right here big sword cool very cool very cool very cool we have marvel marvel section here with captain america and other toys a bigger section here of marvel toys we got little masks over here oh, let's see oh, you know maybe i'll try one of these on see if i can uh let's pick this nice little blue one here see what i look like all right so let's keep going to the marvel avenger section Oh, look at this. This is a Lego section here. What do we have here? Oh, we have... Oh, Santa Claus. Oh, it's looking like the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade. There's a turkey. There's a Christmas tree. Uh, there's the Macy's store with the red bow. All right, let's look at it. Look, let's look at it a little closer. There are the... There's the crowd. There's the police. The NYPD. They're all... Oh, look, at the, look at Batman. Uh, there's uh, people marching there we have the turkey uh, another Christmas tree the reindeer and Santa Claus and there it is Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade that's pretty cool I like that now we have Playmobil mobile some toys here from uh, Playmobil we have games and puzzles Oh, there's uh, the Game of Life, Super Mario Brother Edition, or Super Mario Edition, Operation, Uno, Jumanji, Scooby Doggy. Like, that section for board games is very tiny. Um, usually at Target, at least the one I go to, there's a humongous section, huge, of every board game you can think of it's insane uh you have more uh legos here for 
uh, things like Encanto, something my daughter would like. Again, you, we have Ninjago here. You had the Super Mario Brothers and Minecraft Lego sets here. Batman and Disney princesses here. The Casita for Encanto. You have Mulan there. You have Star Wars Legos here. And now we have Melissa and Doug. Uh, I'm very familiar with uh, Melissa and Doug because uh, my daughter plays with a lot of these toys. Uh, some pretty interesting looking toys here for Melissa and Doug. A little net to catch butterflies or something. We have more preschool toys here. The, the pizza slicer for Melissa and Doug. You got the ketchup and mayo toys over there. We got some vegetables and some fruit over there. It's pretty cool. We got this uh, this pail and this uh, shovel. We got pet care, kitchen accessories for Melissa and Doug. A pasta set, a little ice cream maker, a little ice cream scoop, scoop, scoop and serve. We got kitchen accessories over here. Taco and tortilla set. Ooh, yum, yum. Yum, yum. Mm, yum, yum. La patisserie. La patisserie. Mm, yum, yum. Ah, so here we go. There's a, there's the clothing store that takes you away from the Toys R Us experience because you just see some random clothes. Uh, random kids clothes all on that section. We have uh, Thomas the Train. Thomas and Friends. We have Fisher Price toys over here. You know, some uh, walking toys for little babies who are starting to walk and stand on their own. We have some Thomas and Friends trains. I guess they have tracks that you can set up at the house. More preschool toys here. More Thomas and Friends here. I'm not trying to go as I'm, tr I'm trying to go as fast as possible, but not too fast so that you can at least see what the toys are. Because um, then if I just go slowly, 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 this video is going to be uh, hours and hours long. So you got the super pets here, more Fisher Price toys, like this little tablet over here that looks like a whale. One, 20, one to 20 count. That's pretty cool. And the Uno. Uh, little Uno deck. Cito for the little kids. Citos. We got a little typewriter Cito right over here. And a little spinny thing for the little kids. We have Paw Patrol here and the Nickelodeon section. Uh, it looks like the Nick Jr. section. We have Baby Shark. A little, pl a little, little, little daddy shark right there. That's pretty cool. My daughter doesn't have that one. We got the little octopus. Little green octopus. We have uh, William, William the fish. That's pretty cool. They have a lot of them. A lot of, a lot of fluffy toys here. We have this cat from uh, Alice in Wonderland, I believe. We have Peppa Pig. Peppa Pig. More toys for Peppa Pig here. Some jackets and coats over there. More Peppa Pig toys here. Squeeze as she talks. Nice and soft. Little Peppa Pig houses. We have Baby Shark, Baby Shark tablet here. Try me. Very low, very low. But cute, but cute. More Nickelodeon to develop curiosity and learning. Look at that. They, they make baby shark cars. So my daughter is really into cars now. Cars, the Pixar movie cars. And she loves collecting these cars. And now they make baby shark cars. I wonder if she would like these. Maybe another gift idea for her. What does this do? Hmm. Oh, it dances with you, as per the picture that I see there with the little girl. You got a little guitar over here. 
Oh, look at there he goes. He's dancing along. Look at him dance. Look at Baby Shark dancing. Oh, that was it, huh? Well, it is a try me, but yeah. Dances with you. That's pretty cool. Yeah, you know, my daughter might like that too. Oh, we got the Night Night Baby Shark for Night Night. We got Paw Patrol. Look at that. Paw Patrol is making their, their cars too. They have cars there too. Maybe a little surprise box over there too. Slimy Sand. Oh, what's this? Surprise bowls? What? Surprises for Baby Shark. Wow, you know, my, my daughter would like this too. You can collect 20. Oh, they got Baby Shark. They got the octopus. Wow, they got William there. They got some stars, some starfish. Those are pretty cool. All right. I'm going to have to keep an eye on this. I'm, I'm making a list for myself. Christmas is just around the corner. It is only October 21st. And Halloween is upon us. Then Thanksgiving. And then guess what? Spending a lot of money for Christmas toys. And Santa Claus is coming. Santa Claus is coming to town, baby. Santa Claus is coming to town, baby. Therefore, you know, Santa Claus big time. Big time Santa Claus. Big time Santa Claus. He's coming to town. So behave. Be a good little boy and little girl. And you'll get some toys. These are Thomas and Friends. Thomas and Friends tracks that you can put together. Pretty cool. Have the train go go by. Bluey. Bluey, another very popular toy. And we have Blue. Ah, look at that. Peekaboo. Pika Blue. This one's called Pika Blue. Oh, that's cute. It says little different things here. <laughs> this is cute. <laughs> I love blue. I think I was too old to like blue when I was when it came out. But I, you know, I had little cousins, and they would watch Blue's Clues, and I, I you know, I, I like solving the each puzzle with them. It's pretty cool. Uh, more bluey stuff here. He talks. Oh, he's like waving his hands around. Oh, he's dancing. Oh, he's doing something there. That's pretty cool. We have more bluey toys here. We have outdoor toys. Okay, outdoor play. Looks like a frisbee, a, a ball of some sort. 65% off. Oh, I guess they're not flying off the shelves, huh? 65% off is nice, though. For those that, you know, like that sort of thing. These are Nerf guns here. More glow-in-the-dark or glowy, lighty, uh balls here we got dino squad and nerf guns got little rackets here we got more guns nerf guns nerf uh battling advanced battling i don't know if they're called guns toy guns i don't know but these are pretty cool look at all those look at all those bullets they got in that one well that's pretty cool i got roblox roblox nerf nerf Oh, look at this, a moving goal. Ah, look at that. Little darts here, little dartsitos. Oh, Hot Wheels, here we go. All right, we got some Hot Wheels over here. Hot Wheels section, remote control cars. All right. Back to my childhood with the remote cars. Oh, we got Mario Kart cars here. Mario Kart. Buy one for my daughter, see if she ends up liking it. They have tracks for it. Little race tracks for Mario Kart. Look at that boo one. Look at it. it comes with Shy Guy in there. This one's in Mario Kart. As well with uh, Mario. And this one's with Luigi. That's pretty cool. Oh, look at that one with the chain chop. Look at this big little little motor, motorcycle looking thing. RV looking thing. ATV looking thing. Oh, that's me in the mirror. Look at me. Hi. All these Hot Wheel cars over here. We have... Wow, that looks looks pretty big. Let's see. Kinetic sand. I always wanted to see what kinetic sand feels like. Let's let's take a look. Let's see what it feels like. Does it feel like sand? Oh, it's a little sticky, rough to the touch. Let's see. A little ice cream scoop. Oh, let's see. Let's see if it's like sand. Let's see if we can shape a little turtle seat here. A little turtle. Push it in there. Push it in real good. 
All right. Wow. Look at that turtle. That's pretty cool. Let's make this crab here. Push it in. And let's... Wow. That's pretty cool. So it never never dries up. So that's that's cool. You don't have to store it up like Play-Doh. Ah, speaking of Play-Doh, here's Play-Doh. Here's the Play-Doh section. We have a bunch of... It's crazy how many things they've invented with Play-Doh. They now look at it. They have scent, scented Play-Doh. Strawberry, cinnamon, vanilla. Oof. Look at that. They didn't have this when I was a kid. They just had regular Play-Doh. They, they make pizza. You can make pizza with the Play-Doh. They got a volcano? A volcano Play-Doh. Wow. Little volcano seat over there. We have... What is this? What is this? Rainbow Loom? I guess some... Uh, some other arts and crafty kind of thing. Some cars over here with Play-Doh. I guess like a little garbage truck kind of looking thing. Little, uh, other little creative arts and crafty things. We have a Discover, Create, Brave. Little Frida, Rosa Parks. thingamajigs over there yeah go create there's like the create section the imagination section with play-doh and sand and slime and all of this stuff here look at that doggy look at that tongue over there all right let's see what we have over here play-doh imaginations a little dinosaur we have more little play-doh like things we got nails for the girls so they can do their own nails we have a sewing kit well wow, that's pretty cool a little sewing kit you know there's the playground right over there there's a little stairs for the, for the slide over there oh look at this the history of toys r us famous backwards r and and toys r us name are seen for the first time in 1958 world's biggest toy selection ah, let's see the story I don't want to grow up. 1960, we hear the jingle for the first time. 1965 to 1974, this is what Jeffrey the giraffe looks like. And this is what he looks like from 1975 to 1984. And then hundreds of stores open nationwide in, 19, in the 1980s. Let's go back here. Follow the story. The Jeffrey Mobile rides into town in, 19, in the 1980s as well. 1985 to 1998. This is what... The giraffe looks like that's the one i remember from my childhood jeffrey dollar bucks just for toys one five and ten in 1985 1999 to 2000 this is jeffrey right over here then you got 2001 to 2006 you got a real giraffe representing jeffrey and now 2007 to now you got jeffrey looking like this and then jeffrey arrives at macy's right here in 2022 Look at that story. What a story. Let's, let's let's back up here and get this whole Jeffrey story right here. Get it in its all big collection. All the pictures. All the picture seat that's over here. All right. Looks nice. Very nice. Uh, very good touch. Very nice touch. Very nostalgic touch for everybody who grew up with Toys R Us. You know, or you know, little kids who want to know a little bit about the history of Toys R Us here, which is pretty cool. We have, oh, oh uh, rabbit out of a hat magic trick, looks like. I have a little piano with your feet. Little cars, I guess they look like bumper cars. More pianos. More toys. Oh, we got, what is this? Oh, Sonic the Hedgehog. Let's see what this is. Ah, uh, Green Hill playset. So what is it? Oh, what are you? Uh, so it's like, it looks like you push down on the pump and he runs to or through the loop. The loop right there. Goes upside down and keeps going. That's pretty cool. I wonder if he, he must have wheels on him. That's actually pretty cool. If it works properly, that's pretty cool. That's a pretty cool idea. Gonna have to look that up last act the price you see is the price you get and this is i'm guessing this is their clearance section you got nerf guns here you got some some stuffed animals over here you got some eggs over here for Minnie mouse 
some Nerf guns over here, Fortnite, Monopoly, Discovery. They got, oh, look at that. They got Monopoly for Ghostbusters. A Ghostbusters themed Monopoly. That's pretty cool. More little uh, flower vases over here. We have some blocks. Well, listen, dug blocks here. That's pretty cool. My, my daughter likes blocks. Pool candy. Looks like a little sprinkler system of sorts for the summer. Yeah, that's what it is. Yeah, they're in clearance right now. It's getting cold in New York City. And you can't do the sprinklers unless we get a 100 degree day in October. And this is the store, as you can see from this section. You know, it looks, you know, I, honestly, I thought the, I appreciate the, the pillars looking, you know, blue, green, and orange. And representing the colors of Toys R Us. You got a little bit of, a, of the wall over there by the playground. That's a little bit colored. And you got the little stars here. Oh, look at that. You got Jeffrey. You know, let me find out if I can. Let me see if I can find somebody who can take a picture of me with Jeffrey the giraffe. And I'll show you what uh, what happened. Show you what kind of picture gets taken of me. Let's see. Let's look at this truck. Let's find somebody. Find somebody to take a picture. Let's go. All right, not bad, not bad. Found somebody to take pictures. All right, one with one, one uh, smiling with teeth and one with no teeth. Let's continue. All right, here's the front of this Hot Wheels thing. Another photo op section. All right, here it says, come celebrate Jeffrey's birthday. Uh, Saturday the 15th was the opening day of the store. You have the 16th. Let's see what we have here. Jeffrey's birthday. All right, the 15th is Barbie Day, the 16th is Fisher Price Day, 17th is Jeffrey's birthday. Kids can create Jeffrey picture frame and also have giveaways. The 18th, National Geographic STEM Day, Rainbow Loom Day, the 19th, Thursday, Play-Doh Day. Uh, today, the 21st, is Pokemon Day. Oh, kids receive Pokemon trade cards. Well, I'm not a kid, so I didn't get one. Nobody offered me anything. A Lego day tomorrow. And then Sunday is surprise day. Surprise ball day. Oh, look. Sunday, October 23rd. You can have brunch with Jeffrey. $35 for kids 12 and under. And then $45 for adults. Oh, you can make a little RSVP seat over here. You got some bacon egg and eggs with Jeffrey. And uh, hopefully it's a good breakfast. So I'm paying $45 for it. Maybe a little mimosa seat. Maybe a little Bloody Mary seat. Maybe a little... Uh, a little beer seat, uh, maybe a little orange juice, a little coffee, a little hot tea, you know, a little, you know, one of those things. Uh, head this way for oh so fun toys and games. Uh, that's pretty cool, you know, if, if you happen to be in the city, uh, hopefully it's not too crowded. And here's another section of the store, just so you can get a wider look from this side of the store, from this corner of the store. Um, yeah, the, it just... Um, Oh, there's my finger. I'm sorry about that. Getting into the lens and in the way. But, uh, see, this just takes away the magic. You come to this side and all the Toys R Us, all the pillar colors are all gone. And you have a McDonald's over there. And it just, it takes away from the immersion that I was expecting to come here. My, a very big critique of mine, you know. Here's the elevator section. I don't want to grow up. Here we go, Toys R Us. We have, oh, look at that. The lower level has an arcade and souvenir section. Oh, maybe I'll go check that out before I leave here for Macy's. Um, but as you can see, we have this. And I don't know if you noticed at the beginning of the video, they have like a rap version of the Toys R Us song singing in the background, which I left there for you guys. All right, so I decided to come down here. It's in the lower level past all of the men's section here for the arcade and collectible souvenirs arcade souvenir section the lower it doesn't look like really anything arcadey here maybe some speakers here headphones random stuff look at i mean you know a little sleep aid for your eyes i mean these little macy's things look cool um they got some christmas here stuff again not not arcadey maybe souvenirish maybe for uh, for Macy's itself, you know, a little Christmas tree for your desk, more Christmas stuff here. Um, 
more Christmas stuff. Nothing crazy. Not really worth the walk down here, as it was at the beginning of the section. We have some teddy bears here. We have some Macy's Day Parade collectibles here, souvenirs. Some t-shirts, Santa Claus shirts over there. Oh, here we go. We got some uh, some little book bags, some Star Wars book bags, and uh, Funko Pops, I guess. You know, but still nothing really arcadey here. Um, there you go, right there. We have more down here. A little little uh, coffee coffee cups, coffee mugs here for Grogu, and then we have. Some pink bags here, some more Christmas stuff. Yeah, I guess it's like their Christmas souvenir section for their parade, I guess. 25% off this pink bag right here for the yeah, 4th of July, Macy's 4th of July fireworks spectacular. Yeah, I guess that's what this arcade section is. Uh, there is a curtain over there, so I'm not allowed to keep going over there. But we have, yeah, this is like basically their parade section. Not arcade section, but parade section. But I do like, uh, you know, the art here. The You got Kermit the Frog up there. You know, pretty cool nonetheless. All right, well, that's it. We are on the outside of the store here on Macy's on 34th and 7th Avenue here. Uh, right across the street from Famous Footwear and Foot Locker. Uh, at the end of it all, there's a little NYPD police van. Uh, I'm gonna have to give this Toys R Us uh, just based on expectation a 6.9 out of 10 6.9 out of 10 mainly because I was underwhelmed with the size of the Toys R Us store I didn't get the very big entrance that I was expecting once I got to the seventh floor I had to walk through clothes I had to walk through another uh, kids clothes section before I even got to Toys R Us and even when I got there the the expected boom bang uh, wasn't there you know the walls weren't as colorful as I was expecting it was just a little section within the store which I was very disappointed in but other than that guys thank you so much for watching I hope you enjoyed the video I hope you enjoyed the walkthrough and come visit it sometime obviously if you are in town and you are Christmas shopping, it's definitely a place where you can go while you're shopping for clothes for everybody else. You're shopping for clothes for your family members, shopping for a jacket, jewelry, bags for your girlfriends, your boyfriends, colognes, perfumes. Uh, it's definitely uh, convenient to have, though there is a Target right across the street from it where you can potentially find more toys and a bigger selection of uh, board games and a big disappointment for me was there was no video game section. I remember going to Toys R Us and having a video game section in every single one of them. Not one video game located at this Toys R Us. Again, it is a toy store and you can argue with me that that, is, that video games probably aren't toys. But remember, Nintendo is a toy company and they are i consider them an electronic toy but again if that is not the case anymore then you know again i was expecting it i was expecting at least one tv screen with some sort of video game selection but unfortunately that was not there uh and therefore brought my score down to a 6.9 again lack of uh wow factor for when you actually get to the seventh floor uh, and just not having the immersion that I'm used to being inside of a Toys R Us store, a standalone store, uh, I was missing. There is another Toys R Us located in New Jersey at that new mall, the Dream Mall, uh, American Dream Mall, I believe it's called. And uh, maybe I'll go check it out sometime, see what it compares uh, to when it comes to uh, the Toys R Us here at Macy's on 34th Street. Well, thank you so much for watching and listening to my rant at the end of this video. I'm Leo, I'm Chewing Gum. 
Leo, I'm chewing gum. Stay healthy, stay safe. Thank you for watching. Like if you like, unlike if you don't. Subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. And hey, if you want me to visit a specific store, you want a little walkthrough Sita from it, let me know. Leave a comment down below and I will gladly go to it. Make a little video for you. All right, guys. Take care.